Prime Minister Saint Laurent welcomes Prime Minister Churchill on his first visit to Canada since regaining power in Britain. Good-naturedly, he makes his way through Ottawa's cheering crowd as he begins a five-day visit before returning to the United States to address a joint session of Congress. He next visits Parliament Building for a tour of Canada's seat of government. Again, a large crowd and Mr. Saint Laurent. The two prime ministers and their advisors conferred on future economic and military cooperation. Carrying his 77 years gallantly, he enters Parliament Building and places a wreath in the memorial room dedicated to Canada's war dead. Canada's sacrifices are vividly brought to mind for Britain and the Commonwealth leader as he inspects the roster of the dead. Even as he pays his respects to the fallen of previous wars, he faces the problem of bringing all English-speaking nations into a block that must confront a common foe in any future conflict that may come.